Welcome. Come in. Come in. Um, we don't have any more buckets or milk crates, so you might have to walk on some ants. Are you the guys who registered a complaint with the city? Yes, we are the men registered to complain, yes. Thank you for coming out so expeditiously. We were very impressed with your response. Indeed. We have a lot of complaints. Hutch, the list. I'm not with the city. The city called me because I'm the landlord. I'm from KHB Property Management. We rented this house to Derek and Andy five years ago, and from the look of things, it would seem they've been illegally subletting to you. Look, I don't know what you're implying here, but we have complete authority to live here. We've been putting $550 under a rock every month for, like, over a year. Uh, first of all, the rent is $400. No! Oh! Derek and Andy, not cool. And under the terms of the lease, we have the right to evict any and all tenants effective immediately. Wait, 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 wait. Come on, man. You can't kick us out. We're just little kids. Take, take the bumps off. Show them how yeah, little yeah, we yeah. are. Yeah, yeah. Look how little we are. Check this out. You're not even going to believe it. You're yeah. Before you freak out, we don't want to be here either. Apparently, Derek and Andy were not the badass landlords we thought they were. Our real landlord is some dingus they Mr. Callan who red-tagged our house and kicked us out. Hang on. You got evicted? Yeah. Apparently our house is deemed unfit for human habitation, but I mean, shouldn't that be our judgment? Mom! Mom, 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 mom! Okay, and the worst part is, what if Logan thinks I ditched him? He doesn't have my phone number, and the number I have for him is one number off, but I don't know which one it is. What am I supposed to do? Just start dialing numbers? Anyway, we're gonna be crashing here for the next couple weeks till we figure it out. We're gonna crash here? I appreciate it, Mr. Heck. Not Wait, what about burden, me? But is I was told I was gonna see a book down or something. No, 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 no. no, no, no. Mine is more see, important right I now. I told everyone I was gonna see a book down. Turns out, all this life crap is just one big distraction from death. But it's a pretty good one. So that's why you gotta keep the hope peas on the shelf and for the love of god stay too busy to think i can't live like this anymore meet frankie heck a normal housewife in a normal town in the normal state of indiana but on this halloween she's about to find out that things aren't anything but normal okay Brick, we get it you're rod serling from the twilight zone not even close I'm Rod Sterling from Night Gallery. Less popular, but in my opinion, more nuanced. Well, whoever you are, be him somewhere else. Coming in hot! Oh. Hey, Mrs. Heck, we're out of Doritos. Oh, and uh, Hutch and I are going to leave early tomorrow morning to go to practice. Don't worry, we'll be home for dinner. <laughs> but uh, Kenny's going to be stuck here without a car, so you might have to give him a lift up to his classes. <laughs> What your dad called you in here to tell you is what we both think. Well, you're really the one with the issue. It's not my issue. We both have the issue. It's both of our issue that you were supposed to express to our son on behalf of both of us. Sorry, it's not just her. We are both in agreement that things have hit a breaking point for your mom. Relax. So, you know, Hutch and I are totally focused on finding a new place. I mean, there might be a little overlap where Kenny has to bunk with you guys for a couple months, but, you know, trust me, I'm on it. 